This is Dolany TV, ladies and gentlemen, good afternoon and welcome back to another edition of Edmonton Oilers updates here on the channel. Quick hits for you because, well, ladies and gentlemen, she is the championship. Three games, winner take all, best of three. You're in the slow pitch league I'm in. You don't care, you don't care, but I care. It's, it's going to be a good night. It's cold, it's cool, it's September baseball slow pitch, whatever you want to call it, it's going to be a good time. Anyway, talking about September, that means hockey seasons are starting around the world, unlike the NHLs, which won't start until hopefully December 1st. But again, I'm going to say we'll be lucky to see December 1st, if uh, all just based on, I don't know, the logistics yet, and I don't like how it all matches up, but you just never know. The NHL figured out the bubble, so we'll stay tuned. However, the Oilers figuring out where to place players across the... European League so as they get lots of ice time so they can continue developing, continue playing and not have to sit around and wait for that December 1st date and of course that would mean you've got a guy like Gaetan Oss going back to SC Burn. He is on loan there until the start of the new NHL season. Haas, who has played with SC Burn previously, his last, uh, well, you know what, his last one, two, two seasons prior to coming over to the Edmonton Oilers in 2019-2020, he has played there posting 41 points in 47 games in 17-18 and 38 points in 50 games in 18-19. Of course, that big free agent acquisition on July 1st last season. So there we go. That's on Mr. Gaetan Oss. Now what you need to know is, of course, another Canadian kid, uh, similar to what, uh, uh, yeah, Rogel, Rogel BK, Raphael Lavoie, what he did. Evan Bouchard officially assigned to the, if I can get this one right, we'll be good. No, I'm not even. Uh, Sotertal, Sotertale, Sort of tole, uh, so, I don't know. Look on the Oilers website. I can flash you a graphic if I want. I don't have time to do that. But he's over in the Hockey LX Elsven scan. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I need to slow down. But he's playing for a Swedish club. 20 year old defenseman. He's going to go fit in there on loan. He's on loan there with Axel Anderson, Lucas Fajemo, and of course, I believe there's another one, Samuel Fajemo as well in loans from other teams. So Evan Bouchard, the other Canadian, Matt Bailey, on that team as well. Evan Bouchard will fill in. Matt Bailey, who's got a contract there. Matt Bailey has played. I, I just want to get a quick update on Matt Bailey, who's from Oak Bank, Manitoba. He's played most recently NHL quality hockey or NHL close to NHL hockey with the Stockton Heat back in 1617 in the Calgary Flames system. So a guy that Evan Bouchard would have never seen at this point, but uh, a guy nonetheless that he's going to definitely have somebody to get along with, that's for sure. So Evan Bouchard, right, top prize D prospect. Let me get a couple of stats here for you. So let's go past statistics. Let's go 2019-2020. Kind of the leader on these team. Nick Olinson is the leader for the team last season for the... Uh, the club. So that's what you need to know there. Fun fact, remember this guy, they had Justin Pogge in net for 10 games played back last year, did the Swedish team SK that Evan Bouchard's been loaned to. Anyway, I run on way too long. I gotta get out the door, get to go, get going slow pitch, maybe something later on tonight. I'm Tyson, this is TV. Uh, pff, sorry, I'm up on Oda here.